proceed with the vows. Dearest Lily, you're the hemlock in my veins, the cobweb in my brains. I want a boogie hoogie hoogie, so we just can't boogie no more. My sweet pussycat. I knew from the moment I saw your flat head and that cute little scar that I wanted to spend every moment tightening those neck bolts. All I ask is that we spend the rest of my lives growing disgracefully old together. <laughs> and now the rings. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yo, yo. <laughs> yo, yo. Oh, <laughs> there they are. <laughs> Herman, do you take Lily Grisella to be your lawfully wedded wife until a stake to the heart do you part? What a cream puff. Yeah, I do. <laughs> Grisella, do you take Herman Herman Munster as your, your husband until the loss of electricity do you part? I do. If anyone objects to the marriage of these two wretched souls, speak now or forever hold your peace. I, I was just going to say good luck. You're going to need it with that big dump. I now pronounce. 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 Oopsie. I now pronounce you, Mr. and Mrs. Munster. Oh yeah. Pardon me. Can someone please call 911? Come on, Hermie. Mrs. Munster wants to start her new life. <laughs> Mrs. Munster. <laughs> Hi. He's your bloody problem now, mate. Huh? <laughs> <laughs> Some of the homeliest people I've ever seen. <laughs> I noticed that too. And they sure have a funny way of reacting to foreigners. Some of these customs seem downright rude. Well, wait a second. I almost forgot. I think this will solve our problem. <laughs> we'll have no trouble blending in. <gasps> oh, Pookie. You look so continental and suave. <laughs> I hope they don't confuse me for Marie Chevalier. magnifique. <laughs> 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 Look at mine. That's the height of French culture. Very classy. Oh, right about now, I think I could use some culture. 